6 30 in the morning here in Evanston, uh, Wyoming. Uh, <clears throat> we're about to go inside a store and get a coffee. Uh, I did my PTI already for about 10 minutes now. And um, yeah, just to show you guys what's the condition here. It's currently snowing and it's gonna be, we're gonna hit snow. Um, in the road well so uh, we are we have a delivery in Salt Lake City at 10 a.m. and it is now 6 30 and the reason why I want to start early because the road will be slippery and it's gonna be snowing uh, all the way there 90% um, snow so the road might be really slippery so uh, gonna take uh, gonna take it slow and uh, slow down and yeah that's what we need to do I'm gonna bring you guys with me and um, show you guys the life of a trucker a Filipino truck driver from the Philippines I've been trucking for about seven years now so safe on the road thank god I still have the job so uh, to all my followers thank you guys so much for following me on my Facebook page um, Instagram and my other social media platform such as TikTok and YouTube so thank you so much guys for all the support anyway let's go inside now actually last night I got here around 9.30 and um, it's hard to see the line if you're if you are in the in the spot, you know, because it's very icy. It's, it's full right now here. I didn't have to pay for the parking because I found a spot. Just lucky. Anyway, I'm gonna take a video for my story, Instagram story, guys. Morning here in where is it uh, Evanston Wyoming a pilot travel center just about to hit inside the store get a coffee for my before we start driving it's currently snowing here guys we're gonna hit some storm in in the road uh, we have a delivery today in Salt Lake City Utah. Okay. 
morning. Hey, I ain't seen that. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> morning. Good morning. Uh, you know what, guys? I didn't really sleep well last night. I need energy. I need energy drink. Let's see if they have some offer here on the pilot app. Sometimes they have deals. Let's see. But I won't get one for one dollar. Oh. Monster. But I won't get one. Just to connect it. Fifteen ounce. Let's see if this is this offer here. find something here guys I don't forgot I know I'm gonna get something here
Hello. Hello. Good morning. Copy? Yeah, refill. I believe this on the app it is buy one, get one for one dollar. Yeah, it is. Cool. Ten dollars, two cents. Ten dollars, two cents. You too, thanks. You see, it's starting snowing now. <clears throat> it's gonna be bad later. Got my coffee here, guys. Oh man, this snow, when this is gonna stop? It's hard for us truckers here in the road delivering the goods for you guys. Yeah, gotta move, we gotta deliver this load. So hopefully the road will be friendly with us guys.
showing a heavy traffic in route guys because again uh, everybody's slowing down because it's just snowing you know the road is slippery just lucky because my trailer is heavy 40,000 pounds so I got some, some traction on my tires be there before 10 hopefully the road will be friendly to the Salt Lake City we're gonna hit some trap for a uh, heavy traffic there for sure because we're still in Wyoming right now hey Siri 
Send a text to Vista Martin. What do you want to say? Okay, bro, I will. Thank you, Siri. You're welcome. That's all I use. Hands free. So yeah, guys, we were in <clears throat> Denver, Colorado, this load. I got it there. Uh, it's about 600 miles to Salt Lake City. Last night, I was about to drive all the way down there to Salt Lake, but I kind of worry about the parking because, you know, Salt Lake City is not a, doesn't have much of truck stuff there, you know. Uh, so, and also it will be, by the time I get there, it will be like around 10 p.m. And made me worried I'm gonna be able to find a spot, you know, I'm gonna be able to find a parking there. So I decided to just stop right there here in Evanston, Wyoming because um, I can still find a parking, you know, but if I drop all the way down there, yeah, I'm going to worry about the parking, so which is, you know, which is bad because you're not sure where to go. <clears throat> Plus, my delivery is not until 10 a.m. anyway, but actually my ET right now is about 8 maybe 8.40 see because it's showing heavy traffic right now yeah it's 8.49 so it's just perfect it's already what time now it's only 7.05 right now here actually it's only like a, an hour and 10 minutes drive to there but the thing is since Crossing border, since it's Utah. snowing and in, in this bad weather condition showing uh, traffic right now so we'll get there in two hours hopefully <clears throat> all right we're in the border of Utah now
you guys um, um, you are you are new drivers you know like it don't matter how slow you run or how slow you drive the truck but at least you know that you're safe because you're not driving too fast that's the best tip I can give you guys to just slow down just like this you know um, so far um, thank God thankfully I've been tracking on for about seven years not almost seven years but I get no accidents at all thankfully you know I see a lot of truck chuck knife already on the road you know uh, not worth it you know like there's trucks like when the road is slippery and going downhill they drive too fast and that's why they end up chuck knifing the truck you don't want it it's gonna be your um, end of your trucking career the chuck knife miles away to Salt Lake City guys almost there hopefully the change doesn't re it's not required because if that is might be late for our delivery because changing the tire can take can take a little time
I didn't see any sign yet that the change is required. Hopefully not. See that car? Without a signal on. Crazy ass. irritated me when when cars or any vehicle that doesn't turn on their uh, blinker when they try to pass or you know get back in the lane I hit it isn't too bad just yet so far so good here I didn't see any crazy traffic just yet yeah Kroger road like this slow down just see slippery guys chain is required by state here oh man we're almost there all we gotta do is we're only like 35 miles I didn't see them chaining though there's a flashing light that says that says chain is required fine though let's see
past these drivers. I'm gonna let me see if Man, because training is it's can it can take a while man. Probably can take like an hour. It's been a long time I haven't done this, you know. Oh man, it is what it is. The last time I chained my tires was how many years? It was like a few years ago. I'm gonna ask these guys if they're gonna chain up. Ah, oh, let check. I'm gonna do it though, I mean, it, we have to do it if it's necessary, you know. Hey bud, are you guys stopping here to chain up the truck with the I'm tires? I'm not gonna do it bro, it's clear. I know. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Is like, where would I'm almost? I gotta deliver in Salt Lake City, I and I'm like, Salt Lake too. yeah, and I'm like, we don't need it because the road is clear. Yeah, you know? I was checking you got right now, and it's fucking clean, bro. You're just gonna break the chain. I know. It's like, I don't know if we can go. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna go, bro. You're just gonna go? Yeah, because you're gonna. It's gonna. It's just a hazard, bro. They're gonna fly off and drive it off. I know it was back. It was bad back there in, yeah. in Wyoming, but we didn't require it there. And now, see, the road is clear, man. Yeah, it's clear. I think I'm seeing more too. I haven't pulled off here, so I don't know, but... You're just gonna wait, huh? Yeah, I'm just gonna see what's up. Because I think it's up there when we get back on the highway. Right. But, yeah, I'm not... So these guys are just waiting too, just like us. Yeah, I don't know, bro, because that guy <laughs> over there was chaining up. And then, uh, what's his name? Uh, the guy that was chaining up, he was like, yeah, I'm gonna wait for you guys. And then I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna wait for the guy that was chaining up. And then, uh, I was passing by, passed by two trucks, and they had chains. They chained? So... Man, it's been a long time we haven't chained. It's probably like a few years ago. Oh, and I don't know if I can still... I mean, I can still do it, but it's gonna take a time, you know? Yeah. Bro, it's, it's, it's clean, so that's what I, was, I was literally checking you got right now, and I'm like, it's clean. Bro. I know, I, I see it too. There's no snow. Yeah, see, these trucks right here, they're not chaining though, see? Yeah. I don't know, I think I might go up there and check it out, but if not, I'll probably wait up there, because I don't know. I don't yeah. I'm not going to chain. Me too. Takes a while, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, bud, thank you. I'm yeah. just going to kind of like wait for you too. If you go, I'll go. Yeah, I think I might take off. Alright, man. I'm late to my appointment. <laughs> Me too, I got a 10 a.m. delivery. Oh shit. Yeah, where you head? Uh, which place you're going to? Maybe it's Nicholas the same. Company? What is it? Nicholas and Company? Oh, Nicholas Company. Oh, it's different. Alright, man. Yeah. Appreciate it. Alright, bro. Yeah, drive safe, man. Sure, yeah. Chain is required here, guys. I mean, the road is clear, but these guys are not chaining up. I asked them, and uh, they say they're just gonna wait. Um, I'm just gonna follow these guys. Like, I was talking to one of the driver there, he's not chaining up. I'm not gonna chain because it's gonna take a while. But if it's really, really required, then we gotta do it, you know. I didn't see any state police yet. Normally, they would stop you. Guys. Actually guys the road is clear literally like show you guys so I'm just gonna follow these guys too 
you know? I mean, well, I'm not gonna say, any, say anything anymore, guys. See all these trucks? <laughs> they're not chaining, so they don't have chains on their tires. These just go. supposed to uh, No, I think it's good now guys the, the the light is not flashing anymore so I think we're good I don't have to chain just like a uh, warning you know see that sign there it's not flashing anymore so I think we're good the guy just took off <laughs> so we're good thank God I mean guys if we gotta do it we gotta do it you know what I mean but man I got a delivery to make road is clear no light right here because we gotta chase see the sign is not flashing anymore so we're good we're good Seven miles away. I just don't understand why they require the chain here when it's okay here. Back in Wyoming, it was bad. It was bad back there, and didn't require the chain. But here, I mean, it was okay here. I don't think we're going through mountains anymore. All right, guys, I'll give you guys an update later and see what's up. Uh, my battery is almost dead, so I gotta charge it to I can take more videos.